will be playing the 50 watts. Um, my friend Schmalle here, he uh, jacked in the 100 watts, but then you would have completely different hair. And you would all look like this when you <laughs> <laughs> Is the balance okay? Is it too much music, too little guitar, too much Swedish people in here, or is, uh, <laughs> just... Ja, ging alles ganz schnell über die Bühne. Was soll ich sagen? Schön, dass du hier bist. Schön, dass ihr da seid. Ihr könnt alle nach vorne rücken. Danke, Georg, Leni. Danke, Matthias. Thank you. Let's rock and roll. Yes. Yes. Matthias, ich komm. Hey. Woo. All right, uh, my name is Matthias Eklund and I come from uh, Sweden, Alter Schwede. You have, uh, like, is, are you from Sweden? No. No, you just have a Swedish hat. Yeah. Okay. Viking horns. <laughs> <laughs> um, I play guitar. Hey, it's a yellow guitar. Um, it's got my name on it, the short version, called Ida. And I also have a matching pick. <laughs> Same logo. Um, I play Laney Amplifier, and um, I've been playing these amps since 1996, and um, I'm just shit happy with it. Uh, I use it because I just like it, uh, and if something works, that's the point, you know. If it works, don't don't uh, fix what's not broken. Ooh, we're gonna have some feedback here, so anyway. Um, I don't really use any effects. I borrowed some kind of boss pedal here. That's to turn the distortion on and off. Now it's off, now it's on. Whoa. So, yes, <laughs> uh, I have a Wawa pedal, but it's mostly to make the cable longer. Uh, sometimes <laughs> I use it like the wind in the air. And I will distortion. But I don't really, I'm not a, a you know, I, can, I can't play any Hendrix songs. I use it more like a filter. Uh, so, um, um, that's it. I have Brazilian cables. Uh, they are organic, which means if you're lost in the Swedish woods and you've got nothing to eat, you can eat this cable. <laughs> and I'm a vegetarian, so well, I hope it's not made of some dead animals. I'm not sure. Uh, it's very good. Um, I use very thick picks, two millimeter picks. Um, and uh, what else? I don't know. Laney amplifier is really good. I think I'm going to play a little bit and just warm up my fingers from all the stow. So we had a lot of stow. So um, I'm, I'm just going to play and we'll take it from there. When I play, I improvise, which means I haven't got a clue what I'm doing. And it's okay because sometimes uh, life is a big scheiße and sometimes life is. Anyway, so. Um, and then I figured out that if I play the first note uh, as a D, uh, which is a D, uh, as an harmonic, and play the rest of them without choking it, I got this typical Matthias Eklund kind of sound. So you have to figure out what your moustache is. Uh, you also have to buy 10 Laney amplifiers. Uh, never mind. Uh, here we go. I think here. Come on! Mic my foot. <laughs> is this good? 
Does it help? I'm such a professional and serious guy. I know this is supposed to be an amp clinic, but... Yes! Now we can hear the beat. I improvise! I am from Sweden. Anyway, now we have 516, four times, which is the same as 54 one time. Let me hear you. Excellent. Which is... But then it's slightly too long. It's not really groovy. You can't dance to one, two, three, four, five. So we clap one and three, which is one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four. So which is one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, one. Okay? Now your turn. Do this. Your feet. Okay? And don't be afraid. Don't don't do this. Yeah, nobody. Uh, I will put you all on YouTube. So uh, do this. Okay? Step on it. All right? Don't be afraid. I know it's a dead carpet. And now we clap. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay? And one, two, three, four. And one, two, three, four. thing is actually to, to, uh, <coughs> I didn't want this, I want to see a lady clinic. Uh, this is actually a good thing to, to practice when you sit alone, instead of playing Nintendo all night, uh, you sit at <laughs> So, <laughs> it goes like this, I play, this is the beat, and I go, uh, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, eleven, thirteen, and one. So. like 30 second notes triple as well. So it was really hard to be cool and it was windy, it was outside and all my, the notations were flying to hell and I tried to, I just wanted to... No! no. So, but I actually liked it. Anyway, let's do a song called There's No Money in Jazz. You said Beethoven, you nasty man. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thirty years old in Sweden, I drank Swedish beer, which is, uh, as I like to call it, 
uh, piss. Anyway, <laughs> I German beer. Actually, German beer and German bread. God damn it. I've been around the planet so many times. I've been all over the place, all over Southeast Asia and whatever, South America, the America, uh, Iceland, India, Borneo, Malaysia, Vietnam, whatever. Germany, the bread that doesn't take prisoners. You shit like a horse. <laughs> we go to France, and I love France, vive la France and everything, and it's all baguette, 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 baguette is white bread. In Germany, like one slice of bread is just like as heavy as a Volvo. <laughs> That's all we need. I had four serious dark black slices this morning at a hotel outside of Liverpool. And I tell you, tonight, it's coming <laughs> at my hotel in Köln. They have to, uh, I told them, yeah, never mind. Yeah, yes. <laughs> If you think it hurts with tapping, it's like, ah, 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 and so on. You can come to Sweden, drink beer, throw yourself out the window, cut off your finger, and so on. Uh, I'm gonna start like a basic surgery on the road, I think. So, do you like tapping? Yes, okay. <laughs> and here you go. So, like two euros and an infection to go. Anyway, uh, I use a lot of tapping, and tapping together with arpeggios. Do you know what an arpeggio is? Yeah. Yeah, okay, it's like it's just a broken chord. If you have a song. My mother was a horse, or whatever you call it, and um, you break this one down, you have an arpeggio. This is not a cool arpeggio, and you can't sweep pick on two strings, so maybe you can, but it's turning into boogie woogie. Uh, yeah, so you won't get any uh, free picks from Schmalle here because you need, you know, really, really beefy. Uh, but tapping together with arpeggios is the best way to look at the guitar uh, as a piano and work with really big intervals, you know. You can go from one place to the other really fast. Whereas if you have to pick every note, I like Aldi Miola. Uh, you know, it's you're in trouble if you're in your uh, you joined a band and you don't like tapping and arpeggios. And the first thing the band leader wrote was a song that went. <coughs> Try to play that without tapping. It's not gonna happen. Uh, so for me, it's just I use whatever technique I, I can to get the sound I hear in my big fat Swedish head. Uh, you know, so tapping is good. 